Hello there guys, welcome back, I am Warlord uh, and welcome to another episode of European War 6 um, I will post this video just after I post the video of the Battle of Yorktown because I wanted to make a video when I include the two battles but uh, I'm running out of storage in my cell phone so I'll have to post them separately but uh, we'll just go straight for the campaign. We have already say hello and that well, everything, all that stuff. So, Westward movement. Conflicts along America's Spain border got worse after Americans took Louisiana. Local Aborigines pushed and helped by the Spanish. Also attacked frequently, so America started to plan to eliminate border threats once and for all. Our last campaign. Pain with the United States of America. Time flies, huh? So heavy artillery, but let's go with Jordan. Do you have your grenadier? Gates. Cavalry with brown. Heavy cavalry. Malaysia? I don't think so. Rifleman. Reed Clinton. Oh no, no. That's not good. So this guy is receiving 125 damage from cavalry so I'll attack with brown and start thinking about building artillery We have 16 turns to conquer this city, this city and Dallas. Oh, I had hope I could attack again. So, for turn and we already have accomplished the conquest of the first city. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's move against that aborigines. We'll more artillery. Actually, we will not build out chill because you, if my memory is not mistaken me, I think there's a, a factory here. We'll have to make our troops pass by there. As you see, so seven turns to cities, but when you conquer the second city, it will appear these these three aborigines troops came from basically nowhere, and will start to make your life quite difficult. But if you're smart enough. You can destroy them pretty easily. So here let's start to build blast. 
and we'll not wait we'll go straight forward to Dallas as fast as possible also take Jordan you cannot attack without Jordan and the other artillery So we have already here the Spanish general that was in Dallas. Almost destroyed, should be destroyed by the next turn. Let's just upgrade the city so I can build a more powerful artillery. Alright, I have to wait for the next turn. So far, so good. So the Aborigine threat is definitely eliminated. The Spanish still left to destroy. We're going to put that on practice. Man, that general don't die. How much like that? 14. Another strike should end him. Now that's better. Another blast here. Already use this. So as you can see, use a blast, and you will get. Um, I just get 48 of damage in the city. Use another blast. More 48 of damage. I think I can get the city right away. No. Wait. Yes, I can. So, that's it. We end the Declaration of Independence. Victory. After the bloody battles of American soldiers and civilians, the British colonial powers completely expelled from North America and the United States finally gained its independence. So, we finished our very first campaign. Tomorrow I will post a video, uh, not of a campaign. We will continue to uh, I will continue the walkthrough for the uh, French Revolutionary War. But in the next campaign, we could go just right forward to the French Eagle that I have already started. I'm actually in the last mission. That still. As you can see, I haven't done yet. I have accomplished the three the missions with the three stars. But we will start with the Dominion of Canada. So, this is the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, see you next video.